Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. We love staying two steps ahead of everybody else, and we try to perform uh, miracles, and we don't always hit that mark, but we do our best to keep you in the loop and really provide practical knowledge in, well, potentially things that uh, you can use right now. Uh, we just uh, found out that if you are a Direct TV subscriber, you can update to a new HD guide right now. You don't have to wait. Uh, this is something that uh, one of our correspondence, uh, Angelo Carosio had covered in the aptly titled article linked in the description, how to update to DirecTV's new HD guide right now. Pretty much what I just said. So if you are a DirecTV subscriber, I think you're going to be very happy with this. Um, and you know, I think about the content that I watch on my cable provider. And at this point in time, I'm not on satellite. I use a uh, Comcast, have not yet cut the cord. Have any of you cut the cord and been happy with it? I just I can't find myself doing that. Um, inevitably, when I go through the guide, I look primarily for HD content, pretty much ignoring content that isn't in HD. Comcast does make it relatively simple for me to find HD content. I just go HD guide, and then I'm good to go. And it seems like every passing month, there's new content available on an HD station. Do you guys even watch standard television anymore? Is there is like that's an option? I mean, even the reruns that I watch sometimes are now rebroadcast in HD. I, I have the ability to watch standard television or the 4 by 3 aspect ratio, but I'd much rather watch something in HD. I mean, just the quality. I mean, it's there. The option is there. I cannot... Okay, I can. But I, I, I'm trying to think through my own habits, and it's always jumped to HD first. HD. And it wasn't always that way. Uh, so, whether you are a satellite subscriber or not a subscriber at all to content or you're a cable subscriber, uh, my question to you is, do you search for the HD content first or do you even care? It's just, is it the content or is it the format of the content that is more important to you? Uh, and B, B Brotherhood CCCX says, cut the cord, it saves you money and time. Uh, someone here notes that they have Verizon Fios. Uh, I don't even, through most TV here, is HD, or SD, he notes, standard definition. Uh, ah, and I like this answer. My name is Simple, says, this is my television show. I got to tell you, uh, as we're doing the live TLDR broadcast, it is not, even though it's in a, a different aspect ratio, it's not HD. It's, uh, it's, it looks like it is, because it's formatted in widescreen uh, as, as we're broadcasting out from my home office here in Seattle, the individual clips that we're recording are being recorded in HD on a notebook computer locally. So we kind of bridge the gap between SD. It's not really a... Is the widescreen ratio really SD? Maybe my eyes are cheated. I don't know. Uh, if it's widescreen to me, it's like HD, even if it's not like a, a 720p or a 1080p or beyond. Uh, and, and certainly we'll be looking well beyond here, hopefully at, at some point in, in the future. Uh, so there's a direct TV tip for those of you who are direct TV subscribers like my parents. Uh, it's a one reason to share it. Uh, what do you guys think about content? Do you go for the content or the format of the content first? That's my bigger question to the community if you're not interested in the article that we shared in the description.